back to our channel, Hume's Little Homestead. Back down to Hume's. Good. Today we're going to be uh, working on the golf cart a little bit. I'm going to see. I'm going to have. To... So today I'm going to be looking at how we're going to be putting the batteries into this, and then some of the wiring a little bit. Um, I'm not. I'll be honest. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with the wiring yet because I didn't take it apart, so it's really hard for me to know where things go. So I'm going to have to do some research. But the main thing today I want to do is get the batteries placed in here. So we'll go from to that point. Alright, so this golf cart that I got from my friend, it didn't have, um, pretty much the only thing it had in it was the motor. It didn't have the controller, it didn't have the solenoid. Um, luckily it still has the computer in it, but I ordered a new controller for it, so we'll get that hooked up. Um, once again, I'm not sure where all this stuff is going to go on here. I've got to research that, um, but we'll, we'll get that researched. So and that's then, called a controller? Yeah, this is the controller. Okay. And, all right, so these are the batteries that we ordered, and I'm doing this a little different because this is a 48 volt system, and normally it has, um, I think, six 8 volt batteries is what they have, but those little 8 volt batteries are super, super expensive, so I decided to go with four deep cycle 12 volt batteries, and I think that will work fairly well. See what they look like in here. Mighty Max. Wow. Yep, so there's four of these 12 volt batteries. And this is what I'm going to be placing in today. To see if we can get those taken care of. Where are you taking crypto? The church. On a walk. I did was I just went underneath the golf cart while I lifted it on its side and I unhooked all of the wiring because if you look rats have chewed it so see how it's chewed all the way through on some of them so what I'm gonna have to do is I'm gonna have to repin these and uh, run new wires throughout for some of these most of them look good so the ones that are good I'm just gonna leave yes. but there's just a few that I'm gonna have to to fix like that main wire there that purple one and then you can see they chewed through into some down into here so um so i'm just going to take this out i'm going to take this wire casing off and i'm just going to go through all these wires to check and make sure there's not going to be a short anywhere this one connectors a bit off on so 
and I'm not sure where any of this stuff goes. It's like like I was saying, is a problem. So I'll have to figure out where all this stuff goes to. We'll see. <laughs> I'm hoping that these will just fit right in. Um, they look a little small. They are a little small, so so they're a little a little smaller because they if they're not lined up straight, they'll uh, fall out. So I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to have to get a couple pieces of wood, and uh, I'll just cut it out to fit to size here. Drill a few holes in the bottom so it can drain still, and then uh, put a piece of wood there. I would just weld another piece of metal on, but this is aluminum, and I don't have this set up to weld aluminum, so I can't weld anything across there. But let's try. Fit in the middle, same thing. They're just a little smaller than the, the other ones that were in there. Is that good or bad or? No, it's fine because battery technology has changed so much. Okay. So. Size the size doesn't matter. We just have to make a way so that they fit in there safely. I don't have any wood, but I do have some metal. So I'm just gonna cut out some metal to go in the bottom right there for the batteries. Hi, Crypto. Did you have a nice walk? Did you have a nice walk? Yeah, good boy. Good boy. Very good boy. All right, so I cannot find my tape measure anywhere. So we're just gonna use a ruler and some string and do it that way. So, it'll work the same. I'm just going to cut this in half now and then we'll just put it long ways on both so that way it'll work better than we What? We're going to cut it. This is aluminum, that's why it doesn't rust, but these are steel. So as you can see, there's even a little surface rust on them already. 
So I'm just going to do a quick coat of paint on them. That way they don't rust more. See over there? He was huh? digging. Alright, you're gonna place. Is that gonna work nice? Huh? Is that gonna be nice? Yeah, I'm gonna have to build some kind of a tie down or a hold down. This is what's called the controller. This is the brains of the golf cart. So this is what everything goes into. So we're gonna give it a shot and see. That's it for the work today on the golf cart. Okay. Drive it in for me. We're going to drive it into the garage now that it has some parts on it. So it can be locked up. Yeah, that button doesn't work. Oh, yet, it's but... not working just yet, buddy. That's what we're doing. We're fixing it. Push that. Yeah. Oh, never mind. My brother's here. Let's pull it back out. <laughs> Get on and ride, Emmett. Here they come. Solenoid. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> so what does the uh, solenoid do? It may go like this. I couldn't tell you. Where does it go? It goes right here. So usually a solenoid, I think, from my understanding, is it's kind of like a switch. Somewhat. I might be lying to you guys, though. But it just, I don't know. So it just goes right there? Yep, goes right here. Are we installing it? Dolly. Yeah. It's okay. Dolly. Dolly. Are you fixing it? What, what, what are you fixing? What do you see, dude? What do you see? <laughs> what do you see? <laughs> Emmett, what do you see? <laughs> Dark. No. Is life better upside down? <laughs> Why is he doing that? Can you get up? Get him, Margo. Get him. Get him. Get him. Yes, you're Emmett. Now let go. Just on the side. There we 
No. Where are we going? I'm gonna push you around the yard. <laughs> oh, weirdo. <laughs> why, why are you, why did you do that? I don't know why he did that. Hit the brakes. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> don't push the brakes with your hand. Okay. Thanks for watching. That's what we got done today on the golf cart. Where are you taking Crypto? The church. On a walk. Yeah. Have fun. Bye, Crypto. <laughs> You're a little too small to go that far, Emmett. Is that hard? Didn't help Daddy with the batteries. <laughs>